Hi to everyone. This is Yakub. Today I am going to explaining you how to delete a record in our Oracle database by using JDBC. Here is guys JDBC Java program static delete operation with Oracle database. So clearly I am going to showing you. And uh, for that, here I am going to showing one table. The table name is employee. Select star from employee. And in this table, I have a six records with the name Rama Rao, Dilip Kumar, Yakub, Rahul, Aryan, Tony. So six records we have. And from this record, I am going to deleting some records with a Java JDBC program with our Oracle database. Let us see then how to do. So for that, what I am doing. So in my Eclipse ID, okay, in your previous video, already I told you how to create our uh, uh, Java folder in our Eclipse ID. And uh, I am going with same folder, guys. So here is my folder. The folder name is JDBC applications. Just extract it. And uh, simply what you will do, select SRC, right click on it. Here, go to the new and select the class. Now, now I am taking class name is what? Delete employee. Delete employee. Now, I am taking main method and then do finish. And initially, what we will do, we are working with JDBC. So, we need to import one package. The package name is what? Java.sql package. Then simply you can do right this one Java import Java dot SQL dot star semicolon. So once it is completed, now come to the main method, and here you can write the five step code between the try and catch block. Try and catch block. So in catch, I'm giving here exception class like ex. So this is just uh, this object I am going to bring. After that, here I am writing the first statement class dot per name. And here I am writing the loading driver statement oracle dot jdbc dot driver dot oracle driver. Next creating connection with database with the help of connection interface connection on is equal to driver manager dot get connection and this method having a three properties url username and password url is what jdbc colon oracle colon in colon at the rate local host colon 1521 colon xe now my database name is a rose db rose db and uh, my password also my password also rose db i give rose db Now, once connection statement is completed, I am creating the statement stmt is equal to con dot create statement. Now, I am I am creating the query SQL query and uh, executing our application. So, int i is equal to stmt dot Executor i is equal to statement dot execute update. Here I am writing the simple delete query. Then write delete from my database table name is employee. I am going to deleting with a am employee ID. So first you can check your column name. I am going to removing with employee ID. So emp ID we need to use here 
EMP ID is equal to. Now, which record you want to delete? Here we need to provide the ID. Now, come to the point. Here we have a 101, 1001, 1002, 1003, 1004. Now, I am going to deleting Rahul record. Means 1004, I am going to delete. Then here you can write delete from employee where EMP ID is 1004. Just I given the SQL query. So to get acknowledgement, just you can write this one. Here I am returning I and here I given the statement. Okay, one record deleted successfully. Like this, I give in the small message. Then write con dot close. That's it, my that's it, my friends. Just look here once. And here showing the small error. Now we can find it. So just you can remove the double quotes from here and save this code. And once you will run this application, definitely one record will be deleted in Oracle database inside the employee table. Now, let us see our output. Just what we will do, right click on it, run as Java application. So, if everything is okay, our one record will be deleted from employee table. Here, I am getting the issue, the network adapter could not establish the connection. So, what we will do, once we will check, once we will check our connection, sir, oracle.jdbc.oracle driver dot oracle driver next jdbc colon oracle colon thin colon at the rate local host here i did spell mistake okay local host colon 1521 now so now i did some spell mistake here please understand so this because of spell mistake Okay, it's throwing some SQL exception, IO exception. Okay, once it is fixed it, just you can save this code. Again, right click on it, run as Java application. If it is everything is okay, now what happens sir? One record deleted successfully, right? And let us check, is it deleted or not in your database table? Now I am going to back in our database table. Before we have a six records, again, I'm going to executing select star from employee. Now, here, here, Rahul record deleted from our employee table, right? So similarly, I want to delete Dilip Kumar record also with EMP ID 1002. So then what we will do? Again, come, to, come back to the program and this five statements same to same and come to the query part. And here, instead of 1004, just you can write the 1002. Again, save it, right click on it, and run as Java application. Again, one more record will be deleted from employee table. Again, check it here 1002 before we have, and after deleted, again, you can check it. Now, 1002 record successfully deleted from our database table. That's it, my friends. Simple. Try yourself in your laptop. Like this, you can create many examples. You will get more clarity. Thank you.